Get so mad, there's no control in me. My thoughts get so bad, I'm like, I might grab a bat. I don't know my wrath, my blood boils over like. Oh God, here goes. I lost all feeling from my head to my toes. You said some shit that I can't let go, so just stay tuned for the rest of the show. So have you ever felt betrayed? Which is how you see things. Realize something needs change. Cause I know you got me fed up. Let me show you what's up. Enough is enough I'll take a face full of pavement Just to make a statement I know there's no turning back Oh God, adrenaline wasted So mad I can taste it I know there's no turning back I'll do what it takes I ain't making mistakes like that I'll play it on your face To make you go take it back I'll lose my shit I go crazy when I'm mad And when you walk and exercise every part of your body, it helps to, with the skin. There is, a, there is the going, there's a saying that goes, when you walk properly, it helps with your skin, the brightness of your skin. Yes. Early hours of the morning walk is super effective and good because that is when the sun comes out. And when the sun is out, you get the benefit of the sun which is vitamin d i'm going to be talking about some benefits of vitamin d to your body as here you as human vitamin d helps to balance your immune system when your immune system is fully balanced there is a lot of advantage and it goes a long way too when the immune system is strong, sickness and diseases are far from your body. When your immune system is strong, every organ in your body smiles back at you. When your immune system is strong, your skin glows. And people might be wondering, what type of body cream do you use? It has nothing to do with your body cream. It has everything to do with you having a very good immune system. When your immune system is strong, it also helps with your mental when your immune system is strong it helps with your brain your brain is well coordinated and you are sharper and you do things faster and more accurately when your immune system is strong you find you like have no reason to visit a clinic you have no reason to visit a hospital you have no reason to visit the doctors when your immune system is strong believe me you are going to be extra productive with whatever you are doing yes so still on this walk this walk took me about an hour 10 minutes which i'm going to say is not i think it should be up to one kilometer or more than one kilometer of a walk i'm going to look into that and also after the walk you're going to really feel good when i mean you're going to feel good 
you are going if you struggle from from weakness tiredness confusion dizziness after a good work you're going to feel strong the dizziness is going to really stop if you're having brain fog it's really going to go away and when you go on a walk early hours of the morning when the sun is out you enjoy the beauty of the sun yeah you can see the person on the dog walk he's just walking the dog just past it and also walking him herself too which is a great combination of early hours of the morning walk yeah and it's of a great bellner field as well People that are thinking of, oh, sunburn, when you go early hours of the morning, you're not going to be experiencing the sunburn because the sun is just coming out. And that is the sun over there, as you can see. You might be looking at it, ah, the sun is not very, it's not really out yet. No, but this full benefit of the sun is out. Yes. Vitamin D, you can go check it out. Or watch my you my going to be bringing another video for you to see that is me over there that guys talking under the background that is me and that is how I look for now you might see I'm, I'm looking super rough but I'm enjoying the benefit it has to do with a lot of discipline I made up my mind I have to discipline myself to do this work if you watch people are not out yet vehicles are not out the whole place is so quiet I just decide to show you guys the the road how it looks and how quiet every part of it looks too so that way you're going to see that people are not yet out some people are still sleeping yeah i'm just having a good time giving myself a deep breath deep uh, breathing deeply is super good when you breathe from your in inner stomach out slowly you breathe as you're doing this exercise you are helping your lungs you are helping your heart you are helping the organs inside of your tummy is a very good way of exercising and it's also a beautiful way to stay healthy and to stay fit yeah this is the session i am in i'm i'm, blog I'm vlogging with my phone I hope you guys are enjoying it. I really appreciate you sharing this video, thumbsing up this video, and I would like to hear your thoughts about early morning work and the benefit of vitamin D to human. It's so good. The storybook from the library. We are the key section. We are the library. So this story was pick and pick. It's a story about the honeycomb. Curious judge. Yeah. So it's talking about Drida, Drida, Drida. He says. George eats up his, his gut before it starts to melt. But something smells so good, just like a little shoot. This is where you come to read books for the children. You sit and relax and read books. We use our quiet voice over here. Easter everyone yeah I'm just going to be showing you the Easter hair going to about to start off today today is Easter Sunday yeah I was just I was not just in the mood to make Easter vlogs but how do you say just coming back from Easter Sunday service and it was a fun one just hold on and keep watching guys how is everyone doing I hope you are doing amazingly well about starting easter egg on so this is it i'm just going to hide this easter eggs all over the house <laughs> this is going to be a fun one there is a, a fun uh, art craft in church i'll see if i'll be able to add something of the, what they did in the church to this uh, vlog easter vlog so i'm just going to take these easter eggs all over the house so they're going to haunt it and the winner is going to get the biggest easter bunny candy <laughs> Keep watching guys. I'm just gonna be hiding this one here. Yeah, nobody's gonna know that there's an egg here. So I'll go to other places to hide. Yeah, 
I'm run out of this pack. I'm going to be picking up the other pack. I'll go to hidden hidden places to hide all these eggs. So this is time to go to scavenge for the Easter egg. Yay! Wow, this is fun. Some people are downstairs, some are upstairs, and don't even know where to start from. <laughs> now people are scavenging for the eggs. <laughs> yeah, there are some there. You're right. Like, I, I'm not to give you clue. I'm not to give you clue. I won't give anybody clue anymore. Clue anymore. Yeah, scavenge it yourself. Go around, look for it. Then I'm going to count the eggs. I'm not giving anybody any clue anymore. Just keep hunting for the egg. Keep hunting. The winner is going to get the Easter bunny. Yeah. My neighbor grandchild is also doing Easter egg. There are children all here. Wow. Wow, they're outside doing jazz. Oh my goodness. <laughs> The same time, guys. Oh my goodness, this is like super easy to find because. Um, oh, wow. The, the guy that came here, he missed this one. He didn't even see this one. Yeah, they are just inside this, inside the snow, looking for all the eggs. Wow. And lots of eggs. Lots of eggs. Imagine, look at the bag. The bag is almost filled. Wow. <laughs> This is fun. This is fun, fun, fun. Wow. Check the palm tree. Check the kitchen. Yeah, now nah, the palm tree is in the kitchen. Just check around. We check in the kitchen. for So you check inside the chairs. Look for what you can find. Hunt. Hunt for it. Hallelujah. Jesus is risen. Yay! Happy Easter, everyone. Let's go count our Easter egg and see who won. Oh, somebody is the bunny, and another person is a chicken. It's like tied, I think so. But let's count and see who won this game. One is chicken. I want is the Easter bunny. Now let's count. Let's count in time. So two, okay. Four. Five, the chicken is counting how? Six, okay. Seven. Oh, bunny is thirty-three. Wow. Not twenty-two. The chicken is twenty-two. Wow. It's the uh, chocolate carrot umbrellas. Yes. And the Easter bunny. Oh, I like this Easter bunny. It looks so cool. Wow, I was was thinking uh, inside this egg this year there's going to be chocolate. So he was really after the, the eggs. Was drag opening all the eggs up. <laughs> there was no chocolate. chocolate, chocolate. Yeah, I was trying to get your chocolate. <laughs> it was empty. 